This month, August 2013, marks 51 years since the failed bomb attack on the life of Ghana's first president, Dr. Kwame Nkrumah, an incident which has often been narrated by third parties who themselves have information handed down to them. Now, GTV caught up with 92-year-old C.K. Asempapa, a former policeman who was part of Dr. Nkrumah's security detail when the bombing took place. He gave an eyewitness account of what happened on that day. This is Mr. C.K. Asempapa, a 92-year-old retired police officer. In the cause of serving the nation, he earned several laurels for valor and dedication to work. We're privileged to see some of the medals awarded him in active service. Mr. Asempapa was part of Dr. Nkrumah's security convoy when an attempt was made on the life of the president. 51 years on, GTV News traced the nanogenarian to his home at Abutiateti in the Volta region, where he walked us back in time with an eyewitness account of the facts as they happened. According to him, the day was 11th August in 1962, so fresh in his memory, when they were making their way back to Ghana from a trip to the upper Volta, now Burkina Faso. The next day, we have to return to Tamale. But when we reached Kulugungu, uh, when we reached Kulugungu, and they said uh, school children were there to see Nkuma and he also calmed down. Whilst he, he, he was proceeding to the crowd when the grenade was thrown, when it landed, yeah. then it exploded. What happened to Dr. Nkrumah? I saw uh, blood. I saw blood. And he was wearing white. His, uh, and they were showing signs of blood. So the driver rushed quickly with the car, turned around and then took him and we came to uh, Boku. Mr. Asempapa, who retired as a DCOP, was personally affected by the grenade. Also, I also had uh, two particles of uh, the breaking grenade, uh, mm -hmm. uh, one on my uh, left hand, uh, left. Uh, mm -hmm. and uh, I don't know the doctor, name. Uh, name. Yeah. Uh, he, he's an European, mm -hmm. and he told me that uh, when he want to remove that uh, fragment, uh, it will mean uh, me more, Did the security detail of Dr. Nkrumah suspect the possibility of such an incident? I never knew of any gathering of anybody as such, but uh, it appeared there was a plan to kill him. I cannot swear that <coughs> Following the how the firing of gun were on until we went and when we were returning, this grenade uh, matter happened. Uh, it appeared there was a plan. It's words of advice for the current generation on the way forward for the country. At our time, if a policeman uh, complaint is made. A policeman is treated to investigate. And then he will not tell me or I will not tell him that if he doesn't hire a, a taxi or any car for me before I will go. But it is happening now. There are those who believe that some of the decisions taken by the first president of the republic after August 1962 
were influenced by the Kulugungu bombing. Abdul Hai Mumin, GTV News, Abuja Teti, Water Region.